Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak your Verizon iPhone on 4.2.7 and this is using Red Snow for the Mac. Now there's a better jailbreak, Snow Breeze, if you have a PC that I recommend and we have a video on that. However, this will be uh, strictly for the Mac and the two things you're going to need is one, the firmware version 4.2.6 to trick Red Snow. Notice that you're supposed to be on firmware 4.2.7 but you're going to need the 4.2.6 firmware. So so this post will be in a link in the description and you can get all the downloads referring to this post. Now you can click here to download that and you'll have the first file you need. Now the second one you need to do is go to the old guide which you have a link on our post. If you click that you'll get to this page and download Red Snow 0 0.9.6 um, RC 1314 and hit the OSX. Now when you hit this it'll go to download. When you download it you'll get a zipped folder and when you put them both into the same folder it should look like this now how you're going to start is you're going to plug in your device now, I do not have a Verizon iPhone so I will not be able to go completely through this but I'll lead you through the steps which will work for um, an iPhone from Verizon now you're going to first open up Red Snow and hit OK now this will pop up what you're going to need to do is browse for the firmware which you had downloaded previously which is right here for us the 4.2.6 and it will process the firmware now this step takes like uh, around 10 seconds and once it identifies you can hit next now the program will work a little bit and then lead you to another screen Now you're just going to hit uh, install Cydia and then hit next. Now this I will not be able to show you. Basically what you're going to do is turn off your phone and then follow the steps on the next page. What will happen is once it successfully works it will take around five minutes and it will flash images on your devices and everything and when it's done your device will boot up and it will have an app called Cydia. Now if um, for any reason it will not uh, boot up what you can do is rerun Red Snow which will be basically opening up again once your device has been jailbroken using the next step browse for the same firmware wait for that then hit next it will do the exact same step it did before wait for that to finish and now you're gonna set, uh, hit this just boot tethered right now hit next now you're gonna follow the steps on the next page where it says hit the buttons and your device should restart and this time city will be working now that city is working I can show you what you're going to need to install to um, patch to the device to be untethered and I'll be moving to that right now. Last step you'll need to do is open up the new app that you got called Cydia. This step is important because if you don't do this you're gonna have to be basically re jailbreaking your device every time you want to turn it on. This will make it untethered and boot normally. So what you're gonna do is open Cydia then go to the manage tab around here then tap sources then above here tap edit followed by add now you're going to type in the thing I have right here, which is http colon slash slash info. So, info, and then tap add source. Now we'll verify this, and then install it. Now the last step we're going to need to do is click on the search tab right here and then search Verizon on Tether and you'll get this. What you're going to do now, just simply tap on it and hit this button to install. I'm not going to do that because I don't have a Verizon iPhone. Once you do this, everything will be complete and you'll be successfully jailbroken. Thanks for watching and if this worked, please subscribe and thumbs up this video.